Hi, I'm here with Trend Micro's Eva Chen. Eva, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me here. Great. I'm hoping maybe you can tell our viewers a little bit about what you think is the biggest emerging threat right now in the security space. I think the biggest emerging threat, or actually is already emerged, is the threat that combine spam technique and website attack technique and malware attack and then at the end it combined to become a bot that steal personal information those combination is the biggest threat and that type of threats is profit driven and it create a large hacker underground economy of more than eight billion US dollars a booming business <laughs> yes <laughs> Wow um, so this is a multi-layered threat then that has to be attacked on multiple levels can you talk about how trend micro is going after that threat yes I think uh, trend micro is creating a smart protection network that's in the cloud be able to correlate different infection threat vector including spam URL filtering and malware infection and at the end will be able to prevent the data data leakage even before the threat reach the user's network. We are very exciting to announce that new strategy of Trend Micro Smart Protection Network, okay. moving the protection into the cloud and prevent the threats before it reach a user's network. And how is that different from what customers may be familiar with right now? I think is the the differentiation is that we can provide faster, better protection because it's in the cloud. It's constantly updating mm -hmm. of all the threat, threat uh, database. At the same time, it's less complexity to manage it because the client is much thinner and there's no need to distribute or deploy that huge pattern file because it's sitting in the cloud and constantly updated. And that's what enables it to be faster. Right, so better protection, Signal client, less complexity to manage. From a, a channel partner perspective then, the VARs and integrators out there, what is this going to mean for them and, and their business and what they can do for their customers? I think the best value they can create is because of this smart protection network, we accumulate a lot of threat knowledge across different industry sec uh, sector. So the VARs for a specific industry sector can pull those threat information related to their customer and then merge that in threat information with their customer's environment and customer's business and create this specific value for their customer about, for instance, financial services industry. They can pull the threat information about what kind of threats specially targeting a financial services company. And my customer in this financial s service uh, industry what is their security policy ranking and how, how is their security uh, status ranking as compared to their peer mm. in the same industry. So I think this is a great opportunity for VARS to really provide security as a business solution in their whole solution pack. And that gives them a way of really targeting a vertical very specifically with some really high-end security information. Right, right. Great. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. I really appreciate your time. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you.